What does the welding program here at West Delaware look like on a day-to-day? -day um, on day-to-day, -day, I guess, you know, we, we we teach anywhere from, last term I had up to 55 kids oh, wow. mm -hmm. in one term. Okay. Um, so we, we have anything from intro courses mm -hmm. all the way to uh, courses that are in concurrent enrollment with NICC. This semester we're offering an advanced um, MIG welding course or gas metal arc welding course. Uh, an advanced shielded metal arc welding course, okay. which is actually the, the the basic course for Piasta, okay. but mm -hmm. for us it's our second level. Oh, and then we also offer a industrial welding class which teaches students about blueprint reading and symbols. The students here are offered the same certificate that the, the students, uh, the adult learners are mm -hmm. through the certificate program that we offer at, in the evenings. Mm -hmm. The nice thing about having students, the students at night, um, is you know, NICC then helps pay some of our budget, which this is a very expensive area. Yeah. So there's there's help with that. Um, it gives the, the high school students an opportunity to come in and get some extra training yeah. throughout some nights. I have usually two nights a week, yeah. I'll have high school students here doing some work okay. as well. Students are also have the opportunity to get, as I said, up to 11 credits, mm -hmm. which gives them almost a semester's worth of the diploma program if they so choose. Mm -hmm. When we initially started the, the, the relationship 13 years ago, um, the certificate program was an opportunity for the individual to, to have at least an opportunity at an interview. Mm -hmm. They know they had done further schooling, so they had the opportunity to go to a company and, mm -hmm. uh, and have an opportunity for an interview. Welding is just like any trade that, you know, some companies are going to demand a little bit more than others and, sure. and some, some uh, you know, some has a higher, mm -hmm. higher uh, quality or, you sure. know, opportunities. So, mm -hmm. yeah, I, I, would, I would say every student that leaves here has an opportunity at employment. Mm -hmm. It's just a, a matter of where. We'll get individuals that will call and mm -hmm. they want to do things. However, you know, now that we've structured our classes now to, to match NICC mm -hmm. standards, so it's, it's a lot more mm -hmm. just welding joints and, and, and practicing for the next level. So, okay. But, uh, you know, I, 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 try to, I try to give my students the opportunities to, to test themselves and to, and to challenge themselves to, to the same challenges I guess that you would face in the industry. We try to, to try to, to suit the, the students and give them the best opportunities for success um, afterward. It, it's, it's always funny because you'll see you know welders from the industry look and see some of the welds and they kind of shake their face and I was like well, you know these were built by 14, 15 year olds. So I said you know what are they going to be when they're 21. Sure. Um, so it's pretty neat to, to, to see that and I think they take good pride in that. Mm -hmm.